All right, emotionally cheating. Uh, hi, Bill. A big fan of your stand up in the stand up in the MM podcast. I wanted to get your advice on a relationship question. I got married to my wife last year in September, who I've known for ten years. Um, prior to tying the knot. At the start of this year, my wife, age 30, admitted to me that she has been emotionally cheating. Jesus, she told you? Why didn't she tell you? As far as I know, no physical cheating on me, which started a couple months prior to us getting married with her 51-year-old co-worker, who's a divorcee with two kids. What? I was completely blind. He said sighted. It's blind-sided. Not sighted, blindsided, and in, and in shock when she told me this. About a month ago, she told me she needs to go find herself. Oh, yeah, she, okay. And has recently moved out into her own apartment, and we are currently separated, most likely headed towards a divorce. That's why she told you. Thankfully, we do not have any kids together. My dad keeps telling me to try and woo her back and work out our marital issues. Even if I could do that, I'm not sure I want someone who has betrayed marital trust and scarred me in such a way. What do you think? Uh, looking forward to season two of his efforts for family. Keep up the good work and go fuck yourself. Um, I think you're in a great position. You should stay there, dude. Fuck this. Okay. Um, you've known her for 10 years. She's 30. So you met her real young. She didn't get to go out and go do everything that she wants to do. And, uh, yeah, dude, I would walk away. You know, if you guys are roughly the same age, dude, you still got a lot of time. And I would, you know, uh, she did you a huge favor. Just look at it that way, dude. Okay. Football season's here. Get the NFL package, you know, start hitting the gym. Just get on with your life, man. That that's what I, I would honestly do. And just, you know, get yourself in a great positive headspace too. You don't have any kids. She was upfront and honest. She's 30. She's, she's, fucking got a tongue hanging out about some 51 year old i don't know that's fucking weird to me but i'm also a guy um uh let let her go man <laughs> you know when you let a fish run on the line maybe tire it out that just i would literally throw the whole rod in the water just let that one get away cut the line fuck that like i said man um oh fuck that dude go travel go to europe go do something i don't know go yeah, you don't, you don't need that shit in your life. Thank God. You know, I actually felt relieved as I was reading that. And when it got to the end that you guys are going to get divorced, you don't have any kids. That's fucking great, dude. You're in a great position. Don't listen to your dad. He's probably old school. It's a hell of a thing for me to say. I don't know your dad, but I just, you know, old people, are they're always into that. Work it out, blah, blah, blah. You know, fuck that. Um, I, I, yeah. Football season. Yeah, da, 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 ba, da. You know, get yourself a kegerator. Just don't get fat, you know, like me.